All right, so this is going to be a Taurus Sun, Taurus Moon, and as well Taurus Rising. Our weekly general tarot reading, May 25th to uh, May 31st, 2020. And uh, in case any of you guys is a interesting interested <laughs> to uh, have a personal reading with me, uh, you can check out the description down below and uh, there you're going to find a link to my website. Uh, from which you can purchase such. So with that being set aside, moving to the Taurus uh, general reading of the week, now we do have the Six of Wands, that is of a great start here, that is the topic and the theme of the week, followed by the energies, wow, which are feeding and supporting the topic itself. Uh, that will be the Queen of Wands. Afterwards, what we do have it is the challenges that you will have to overcome throughout the week, that is to be uh, the uh, Nine of Pentacles. <clears throat> Afterwards, it's going to be the gifts of wow. That, that's getting even better and better, man. I mean, four of pentacles as the gifts and the blessings. Now, the only thing that could really screw your week around, that is the lack of confidence, okay? So you have to be very confident within yourself and within your abilities and capabilities, regardless if it's going to be about career or about relationship here. So the next one is going to be the impression that you are leaving into the people around. That is going to be the impression of the Six of Pentacles. And the last one, which stands as the guidance the Tower is offering, that will be the guidance of the Hierophant. All right, so those uh, six cards. My God, all right. So what happens here is that the energies are going to uh, make you stand out. This is literally what uh, the Queen of Wands is the energy points. Uh, those energies are going to make you stand out into your career and in your relationships um, life as well <clears throat> in a sense of that you are going to become attractive okay uh, to, to, to the individuals around in case you are single uh, and uh, career wise you are to be acknowledged for the good job that you are going to do whatever good job you have done by now you know that job is to be recognized and that is well described here into the relationship, into the uh, situation. Now, those cards go hand by hand. And because of your personality, because of the energies are going to make the uniqueness of your personality, the leadership uh, portion or rather like the leadership face side uh, and, and, you know, aspect of your being to stand out here. You uh, people are going to look at you as a... Uh, and an asset that they need to have, as an asset that they need to pay for, as an asset that they need to compensate, and so on and so forth. So needless to say that you are going to become appreciated into your marriage, you are going to become appreciated into your career, you are going to become um, approached from individuals if you are single in that particular uh, in that particular case. And it's very important to once again have your confidence boosted up, okay, and, and to have that self-confidence moving forward. Now, those energies themselves, uh, they are going to make you, uh, or they're going to allow you, help you, if you will, to do the right business maneuvers, or to associate yourself with the right people that may reside and that will reside in your, uh, in your social circle. That itself leads us to the situation which is apart from a recognition from the Six of Wands, you know, recognizing that you are their person that they need to try to make a relationship with, that you are the man for the job or the person for the job, if you will, if you are a woman, you know, you, that you are the woman for the job. Um, and pretty much that what you are what these people need to proceed on forward with their life, or that you are what that situation need, so the situation to be resolved. And that itself is going to lead to peak of experiences, like accomplishing and reaching uh, a very important milestones from which you can move on forward, you know. And that is the thing here with the Six of Wands, is that while the accomplishments are going to be very good, for some of you, they will even exceed your expectations. You need to know that, that the, the, the grand job, it's far from done, and you should not give yourself a rest, but keep on the good work going here okay um <clears throat> one last thing 
uh, to describe the energies. So what the energies are really going to make you take it that way. Uh, imagine a wasteland, a frozen wasteland where everybody is in the cold. And you, my friends, are the bonfire that sits in the middle of it. And so everybody wants to be around that bonfire, right, to get warm. So that is what you are to be. Having an exceptional sense into the human nature, once again, which will allow you to associate yourself with the right people and have an, an exceptional acute business sense here. So the challenges, that is to be uh, the Nine of Pentacles, and I already said about it, it's about the confidence. You got to challenge yourself to make the leap into development. That it is what the card points, that you can do it, regardless of how impossible it may look like um, from a side or from your glance. That is either the business project or the relationship that stands in front of you, you know, or the endeavor and so on and so forth. The Nine of Pentacles, it's uh, it's the card pointing that you should not take it so personal, right? You should not, um, how can I say, uh, uh, think that if you fail, although it doesn't look like that you will, but that fear is kind of stopping you pushing forward. So if you do fail, that is going to be the end of the world. It won't be. You, you won't fail in generally. So here into the, uh, into the challenges for you is going to be challenging to recognize that that is your big fish. That is your big deal. That is your big project. That is your time to make a big things for yourself, for your marriage, for your relationship, for yourself overall in general and that is well um, described here into the um, energies that are feeding and supporting the topic we do have the four of pentacles and that week is going to gift you with the means with the prerequisites and with everything you need in order to ensure a secure future for yourself to um, establish a domain to create a comfort zone or in generally to feel secure for a long, long time moving forward, either career-wise or either relationship-wise as well. That is the week where you make the moves that will consolidate your to work. That is the week where you make the contract that will secure your home, for example. That is the week where you do make the approach toward the person that you do have a secure future with. So pretty much that we gifts you with everything you need to sort your life out, that to, to, to pretty much uh, stabilize and uh, get in order, get a grip over the, the future that awaits you and over the life that you are living in. Moving next, we do have the impression that you are gonna live into the people around. So that will be the Six of Pentacles and uh, that is uh, quite of a, uh, um, how can I say, ambivalent maybe, an impression. So what the people are going to look at you, when, when they look at you, they are to see a person who really did a hard work so they can get where you are right now. And that you do definitely deserve the, these kind of energies and these kind of opportunities. You definitely deserve the partial success, which can be traversed into a, a, a certain, all right, but the milestone, I mean, you definitely deserve that milestone that you are to reach. And also people are going to um, have an impression that you don't need any help anymore because uh, their help is going to be futile. Uh, not, not, not exactly like that. It's more like they, don't, they will not know how to contribute into your things. You know, they will not know how to help you because they will not see what, what possibly they can do to ease your burdens. Not that you're going to have any or kind of like to, to push you forward, if you will, uh, with your developments. And also very important here to know it is that people are going to see you as a, someone who follows the rules, someone who follows the code of conduct, someone who does not overstay their welcome, someone who very well knows how they stand and what boundaries they cannot cross, which are going to make you a very trustworthy person. And uh, the last one for you, it is the guidance. And uh, that pretty much correlates with the people, with the vision of the people. They take you that way. You make sure you keep it that way. So guidance wise as well, the Hierophant itself points that 
job should never be about the money. I mean, the money are something collateral to the job. You got to do your job because you like doing your job. Money, if you are good at your job, money are going to find you on their own accord. And if it refers for relationship, one relationship, if it is only found and based on love, that relationship is pretty much doomed to fail because you can love somebody as much as you like, guys. If you don't trust that person, if you don't have, uh, if you are not finding reliable, okay, and if you don't see the uh, the vision of a, of a relationship you want within them, then there is no future in it, is it? Is there? Okay, so that is what the hierophant here points, and that is very important, especially if you're single, as you're going to attract a lot of people around. You gotta see what your vision is within this person. And before you fall madly, madly in love with them, make sure that you do trust them and that you do find them reliable. And once that happens, you, my friends, are going to understand what the true meaning of love is. Or the real, I'm sorry, the real meaning of love is. So that being said, Taurus, this was your weekly general tarot reading, um, May 25th to May 31st, 2020. Hopefully you enjoyed it and you liked it. And once again, if you're interested in a private reading with me, uh, checking out the description down below is going to give you a link to my website from which you can purchase such. That being said, we may see each other around. Until then, bye.